Canva just connected itself to ChatGPT. What does that even mean? Stay tuned. I got more information for you. You don't want to miss it. What is up, everybody? I'm DK Hammonds, and I wanted to come share with you the new update that is connecting both ChatGPT with Canva. And so I have the opportunity to kind of show you on the screen. So let's go boldly to the screen and see how we can do this. So the first thing you need to do is you need to go to ChatGPT. I already have it pulled up. Let me make sure I move my screen. I got it pulled up already. I'm going to roll it. So I got it pulled up already. So let's make sure you have that. Make sure you have the paid for version because otherwise it's probably not going to work. So if you're doing ChatGPT and you're trying to figure out how to do it, here's the instructions on how to do it. So let's go for it. So we're going to explore GPT. Let's do Canva. Take it a minute to think about it. Canva is the first application here. Let's start the chat. Uh, here's where it's going to be really important for everybody is you got to know what you want to put in here, right? You, you got to know it. So if your promptings are off, you're going to be frustrated by what it gives off. Thank you, Rocco. You're going to be frustrated by what it gives off. So you now have good prompting. So let's say create me 10 um, evergreen pieces of content with Bible verses. Okay, so that's, that's the prompt. So what it's gonna do, what it should do is create me 10 prompts, evergreen content with Bible verses. Uh, let's say, let's, let's make it more concrete, Bible verses on faith, okay? So bada bing, it's going to think, process through Canva, what it should show me is uh, there's an issue. Okay, it's probably too many of y'all trying to use it. Uh, let's see, create me 10 pieces of evergreen content for IG about faith. Let's see what happens. Okay. I want to create a class about faith. Can you create, create me a PowerPoint about faith? Here we go. So I did, let's create a PowerPoint presentation. Could you share more details? Yes. PowerPoint about faith and business ownership oh, I spelled it wrong. so now it's giving me the slides it's not necessarily taking it to chat GPT because it's probably too many of y'all using this app but here's the slides or what it, what's happening is I'm not connected to my chat GPT and I need to connect it. See? Now, all right. That's the way that it gave me that. So let's start over. Let's do it. Let's do it the easy way. It's a lot of y'all trying to access this camera. It's very clear. All right. Let's just get, uh, let's do this one. See, the first time, notice it didn't give me that because it wasn't connected to my camera. So now we're gonna connect it to my camera. Now it has it. Now it's talking back and forth. That's the API that's talking from Canva to ChatGPT that allows us to create this. All right. So here we go. Let's click on this one. right in the camera. This has always been here. I don't personally use it, 
but it's here for somebody that needs to use it. And think about it. These are already pre-created for somebody who doesn't have the time, uh, can't put in the effort. You can go ahead and use this application to get to where you're trying to go. So this is going to be super dope for someone who wants to create content, don't have time, can't pay the persons to do it. You can use this application to give you some basic level content and be able to design it. Um, so I look forward to using this and I hope you look forward to using this too. It's your boy DK signing off. Peace.